Good morning, everyone. Today we're going to learn lesson four God the Father of All. So let's talk about God the Father. There is only one God, but there are three persons in the Trinity. The first person in the Trinity is God, our Father. We all have a Father on earth. We call him Dad. We also have a Father in heaven, and God is the Father of all of us. God created all the things, including all the animals, plants, birds, and human beings. He made man as the crown of his creation. Your Father on earth gives you good things because he loves you. Our Heavenly Father only gives us good things because He loves us very much. Our Heavenly Father is a Father who will never leave and who will always treat you with kindness and love. We can go to our Dad when we are sick, in pain, in trouble, or for whatever we want or need. Same way we can ask for help from our Heavenly Father by praying to Him. Prayer is our way of talking to God, our Father in Heaven. God loves when we talk to Him. We can tell God about things that make us happy and things that worry us. We can thank God for all that He has given us. And we can ask for help from God when we pray to Him. We can talk to God in our own words, or we can talk to Him using words from a written prayer. There is one prayer that Jesus taught us. The prayer that Jesus taught us is our Father. And that, my children, is the end of the chapter. Now it's time for review questions. Who is our Heavenly Father? Yep, God is our Heavenly Father. Question number two The first person in the Holy Trinity is. That's correct, God the Father, who created all the things. Yep, God our Heavenly Father created all things. Now, this is a harder question. What did God make as the crown of creation? Yeah, you're right. He made mankind as the crown of creation. How can we talk to God? Yes, we can talk to God when we pray to God. Now, let's pray. Our Father in heaven, holy be your name. Your kingdom come, your will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Now it's time to sing a song. Yay!
Now, let us see what we have to do after the Sunday School forever. You have to love all that God created. So you have to love humans, animals, and every creation. Now, let us memorize a Bible verse. Today's Bible verse is, See what love the Father has given us. 1 John 3, 1 I repeat, See what love the Father has given us. 1 John 3, 1 Now, this week's activity is a very fun activity. There are 15 words that appear in the prayer. Find those words in the word search below. See, isn't that fun? Goodbye, my first graders. Have a wonderful rest of your day and make sure to attend the Holy Garbano.